lunch. We're here in Lima and today we are having food from the jungle. Food I know. from the Amazon. How exciting. It's been a while since it, it has been a while. The last time we had that was when we were in Iquitos almost two years yes. ago. And we've been craving some of these things like Juane and Takichi. What's the other one? Takacho. Takacho. It just escaped my mind. Anyways, we're here with family and we're going for a big group meal and it should be really yes. exciting. They've picked out a nice restaurant and yeah, let's go in and enjoy. It's right behind us. It looks a bit like a hut and it is called, give me a second, El Encanto Amazonico, which means the Amazonian enchantment. Yeah. So yeah, let's go eat some jungle food. Let's do it. All right, so we are inside the restaurant. Yes, we with are. With the whole fam. The whole family. The whole came, fam. Which is awesome. Getting settled in. And we got complimentary alcohol. I already forget the name. You, re you remember that? I believe it's uva chalo. Yeah, and it's, it's supposed to be like a grape-based uh, liqueur. Yeah. So it smells nice. Ooh, dulce. It's very sweet. Yeah. Very sweet. Quite refreshing too. And yeah, we haven't even decided what we're going to order yet, but we're already enjoying some drinks. I know, the menu looks pretty cool. Check it out. So we've got some appetizers now as well. Little appetizers. So these are like banana slices or plantain slices. Chiefless, no? So these are called chiefless. And they brought us uh, a sauce. This is ají de cocona. And cocona is a fruit that you find in the jungle. So here you have a bit of the fruit. You also have some red onion oh. and ají, which makes it spicy. So try that. So let's try a bit of that. That may be too much spice. We'll see how it goes. Do you think good? That's good. Whoa. It's like jung it's like jungle salsa. Oh, <laughs> oh it's sour. sour. Really sour. Oh, sour. Ooh, I'm gonna like that. I love it. But it's sour good. Things. I do want more. You do want more. <laughs> you made a cringy face and then you went and got more. That's pretty it's funny. It's tasty, it's just really sour. <laughs> Moving on to the drinks. Moving on to the drinks. So your relatives <laughs> ordered some chicha morada, which is the purple corn drink from yeah. here in Peru, and it's one of my favorites. It's so refreshing. This, however, I do not believe is a drink from the jungle Ooh, because it no. requires corn. Sam is Why eating the Chaufa yeah. from the Amazon. Chaufa is fried rice. Yeah, and I honestly feel guilty because we're going to be sharing this with your mom and uh, she's waiting patiently for us. <laughs> um, well, we get the shot. So, what yeah. is in this chaufa from the Amazon? Can you tell us? Okay, so it looks like we have some different meat and vegetables in here. We have some egg on top. Mm -hmm. And then we have like the, the fried plantain, which is the maduras or something? Yeah, madura frito. Maduras fritos. So, I'm going to actually try that first. Yeah, let's see. Mm -hmm. oh so good, it's so sweet. It's almost like having dessert to start off with. And I'm gonna try the rice now with the meat. Your rice has two different kinds of meat. You have chorizo mm. and you have cecina, which is the, the dry pork meat. I think I just tried the chorizo. Yeah? Yeah, it's really I good. I can see chunks of cecina in there near the back as well. And the last thing for me to try here are the beans. Some beans. Mm. Good stuff. And this is my cecina over here. It's super tasty. I like how like most of it is savory, but then the, the plantains give you a little bit of sweetness. So it's nice to alternate between the two flavors. Oh, and I almost forgot to tell you that I'm trying a, a drink for the first time. I've had pisco sour, of course, but I've never had camo camo sour. Yes. And that is uh, a jungle fruit. Yep. So let's try it. Okay. Oh, wow. It's got quite a strong flavor. It's sweet, sour, it how is, is it? It is sweet. I, I, I think it's one of those, those flavors that like will grow on me after a little while, but let's try it again. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty tasty, it's refreshing, but I, I, I do prefer pisco sour. Yeah, I get the feeling yeah. pisco sours yeah. are more your thing. Yeah. So we're moving on to what I ordered. Yeah. So first up, the salad. We had to Google what chonta means. The main ingredient here is chonta, yeah. and we thought it was bamboo, yeah. but apparently it's heart of palms. 
Okay. Palms. So not <laughs> something we eat every single day, but not here it is. I, I, not something I think we've ever had before. Well, I think we may have had it in Iquitos, but that was a few years ago, so okay. it's not as fresh in my memory. So this is, it's covered in a bit of olive oil, it seems, and yep. it also came with some avocado. Oh, you wow. can also order different salads with like lettuce and tomatoes, where this is one of the ingredients, but we just ordered chonta on its own, so let's try it. Try it. Hmm. What do you think? It reminds me a bit of artichokes in a way. Oh wow, that's oh, interesting. No. It's very stringy. Yep. Also, my aunt was telling me you can add mayonnaise to it. So let's try it. I haven't done this before. Try it with mayonnaise. But let's see if it changes things. It's kind of weird to be. Just pouring mayo on my salad. <laughs> if that's find, how it's done. I find mayo is really popular here in, uh, in Peru. Let's see. You eat it with a lot of different things. This has more mayo. Mm. This is so stringy, it like wraps itself around your teeth. Oh wow. Mm. Does that enhance it a bit? I would say it's an improvement. Otherwise, okay. it's kind of like dry and stringy in a way. I really need to All right. chew on it. Now we need to so. move on to the star of the show. This is your plate. Ta-da! So, for my main, I got tacacho y cecina. Okay. Tacacho is basically plantain. Yeah. They like fry it and smash it down and yeah. make this like mush, like yeah. plantain mush. And here they served it like a little pyramid. Yeah. But when we were in the jungle, we were having it as a ball. Like right. they would take the plantain and they would take the cecina chopped up. Yeah. And they would just mix it all together into a ball the size of your fist. Yeah, and that's you right. Just eat it with your hands. So this is a different presentation. So I'll try my tacacho. And unlike the one that I had, yours is savory, I believe. Your plantains are savory. Although yeah. We'll have to find out. I do That's think good. One. Is it good? That's tasty. But I feel like I need a bit of meat, so let's get some of this. Mm. Tasty? Salty? That's good. The meat is quite salty, yeah. Okay. I think that's why they preserve it. Yeah. With salt. And then it comes with some red onions. This looks like tomato and maybe even cilantro. <laughs> Very tasty. You're, you're going to town on it, so I know it's good. Awesome, I can't wait to try it too. And because our eyes are always bigger than our stomachs. We have moved on to dessert. This yeah. is something I've never seen before. It's called Nyutos. And apparently it's made with the starch from yuca. Yeah. So I've been told. So yeah, they're like these little balls. Apparently they're quite powdery and dry. So you have to be careful not to choke on them. So yeah, let's just bite into it. Mm. Oh wow. They're very dry. Very dry. Very dry. Yeah, you were warned. It reminds me of almond cookies. Okay. Like, you know, the same texture. Dry. Yeah, you kind of need a drink on here. And hand. then we have, I have a, basically a maracuya. It looks like a popsicle or ice yeah. cream to take off for the road. It's called chupete. Yeah. So yeah, just like a water popsicle. And yeah. It's passion fruit. That's right. And that was our uh, that was our meal. And I'll, I'll do price point outside. Our jungle meal in yeah. Lima. The portions were great. It can be here. done. Time to do the math. Yeah, time for a price point. So I thought that was really good value. It came to 105 soles, which is just a little bit more than 30 US dollars. Yep. Um, that included the, th the meal for the three of us. Yep. Two mains, the salad, all the drinks, and the desserts at the end. That was excellent value. I thought the portions were really good here. Definitely come back. And the fun never ends. What are we going to do now? We're going to Parque Kennedy to buy picarones for dessert. Yeah. And apparently the guy comes, what, only after 3 p.m.? After 3. Yeah. Also, I should mention this this isn't gonna be jungle food, the picarones. No. That's no. just a snack. It's just, just a snack. It's just a little dessert. Yes. How many portions, Audrey? So far, three. Dessert time in the kitchen. I'm having mine a bit later. I had to run an errand. So this is going to be really nice. It's out in the hot sun. Chilcano. Wait, isn't this the buenazo? Oh, you're right. 
I'm starting to confuse the two drinks that we have them so often. This is so good. This is like the most refreshing thing ever. Like seriously, if you've been walking in the heat, like doesn't you can't beat this with like ice cubes and like cucumber. Passion fruit juice. Passion fruit juice has got cucumber in there. But let's talk about the dessert before the dog tries eating it. The dog is like frantic poodle mode. Show the dog. The dog is Mackie with his cone. Hello, Mackie with his cone again. So sad. Poor thing, he just can't stop scratching. Okay. So these are picarones. I'm just gonna pick it up with my hand. Why not? So it's got like a miel kind of syrup, honey syrup, I should say. They're deep fried rings with a sweet potato. That's oh, the yeah. key ingredient in the oh, picarones, yeah. a sweet potato. It's a nice sweet treat. I can't believe I'm having a second dessert. All right. Good. The more syrup you put on it, the better it tastes. Mm -hmm. mm. All right, and while you enjoy your dessert, let's give Mackie some love. I need love tonight, I need love. Are you I need love tonight. You can't eat picarones. You can't have human food. You're allergic. Sorry, Maki. If you could eat it, I would share it with you. Okay, say bye, Maki. Ciao, Maki. Bye, bye Maki. Bye. And we'll also say goodbye to you guys for the final time in this video. I know we've, we've ended it a couple of times. We've got a frantic Bye for now. Bye. Bye. Boom.